Hey guys, this is Umax HD, and I think you guys can guess what video this is gonna be on. Um, yeah, of course you can guess. It's in the title and the thumbnail. So you know what? Scratch that. Today, today, I mean yesterday, t yesterday was, was a good day because I was not on Twitter. I have no idea why I was not on Twitter. But yesterday was the announcement of a game that got the One Piece community <laughs> and even myself, me to come out of retirement and the One Piece community to just brighten their face again. Because I have not, ever since Burning Blood, I haven't seen the one piece community like be this active like the last time this happened for us was in uh was back in 2016 with the release of burning blood after that when <laughs> when people saw one piece world secret they just shut down it was over but today we have the announcement or yesterday we have the announcement of one piece pirate warriors 4 now, I'm going to be honest with you. I never saw this coming. I totally never saw this coming at all. To me, I didn't think there was going to be another announcement of a One Piece game until next year. At the earliest, like this year's um, Jump Festa. But that's besides the point. This is, for me, out of nowhere, I'm going to be honest with you again. I never even thought it was going to be a Pirate, War Pirate Warriors 4. I thought it was gonna be I don't know something else um it's I thought it was gonna be well I was hoping for a, burn, a one piece burning blood too I really was I was hoping for uh, not like immediately like just maybe in 2021 or something I didn't want Spike to handle another one piece game until you know they did another game which Bandai made them do one punch man what's the name of the What's the name of the game? I, it was it, it was irrelevant for me, so I didn't care to remember. Uh, One Punch Man, a hero nobody knows. <laughs> That's a fitting name. Um, so we have One Piece Pirate Warriors Four. What does what does this entail for the game? Because the trailer showcased Gear Fourth, which means we're gonna have a story mode from up to. To up to Gear 4. Now, where it starts, I have no idea. You know, not that it goes, I don't know if it goes in chronological order. I don't know if this is like, you know, Pirate Warriors 2, because Pirate Warriors 2 was just all over the place. I mean, the place, because I saw uh, gameplay. To, let's, so, to clear the waters, I've never played any Pirate Warriors game. I only played bits of three, bits of it, and I've never played actual full thing. So, Let's just say my hype levels are not as high as people that have played Power Warriors before, but nonetheless, I'm still hyped for it because it's the definitive Dynasty Warriors game. Like, it does not get any better than Power Warriors 4. That's number one. Number two, Power Warriors games, like, they have their own twist on the Dynasty Warriors IP, and it they make the games, like, better i don't know how to explain it i'm just i'm hoping this game is also different enough as to where i can you know enjoy it because i don't like dinosaur warriors game to be honest i find them highly repetitive it's not like that fun to me you see i can't i can't say i liked pirate warriors 3 because it felt you know it's, it felt as repetitive but there were People, my friends told me there were things that made it stand out from the Dynasty Warriors game, so. Hey. And people actually like, like people, a lot of people prefer that, the Power Warriors series, over, you know, Burning Blood, which, that's cool, that's fine, because it's not a bad game at all. Power Warriors game is the, I have to say it's the best, I have to put my personal bias aside, is the best One Piece IP we've had I'm trying to think of something better but see that's the thing when you have three games you know back to back if One Piece World Seeker had a sequel it would be better than One Piece World Seeker and if it had a third sequel that'd be even better so 
you know, saying One Piece Pirate Warriors is the best One Piece game we've had is not, you know, an accomplishment because if it wasn't for two and three, we wouldn't, no one would ever care about One Piece Pirate Warriors. And we've not had a sequel for One Piece Burning Blood or One Piece World Seeker. So that's why I wanted to, for them to either do a One Piece World Seeker 2 or One Piece Burning Blood 2 because we've already seen One Piece Pirate Warriors um, sequels. I'm not saying, I'm not saying that's it for the series. I was just saying like, we've seen that. Let's do something for these games. Let's have them be better than what they originally were, the foundations that they set. But nonetheless, I'm still hyped for Pirate Warriors 4 because like legit, best One Piece game we've received in the past two generations. People actually, wait, hold on. People actually like Unlimited World Red. Are you serious? <laughs> hey, you know what? Let me stop. But really though, I'm hyped for One Piece Power Warriors 4. And I'm, I'm hoping to see a lot more than 3. A lot more than was in 3. I have no idea how long this, was, this game was in development for. So, I'm hopeful. But anyways guys, post your comments down below. There are more videos to come please leave a like subscribe you know all that good stuff and yeah so please tell me what you guys think is it good is it not good is it you know do you dislike pirate warriors or do you just think they're just repetitive like i do i mean the combat is repetitive like i do and yeah i'll um see you guys next time Please post your comments down below, give the video a like, subscribe, hit the bell icon. It's been you, Max HD. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.